Hello, everyone. Considering the audience I have the pleasure to address today, I'm sure you all know the key for successful investing is to design a diversified and balanced investment strategy before executing any trade, as it's the only way to manage risks and to limit potential catastrophic losses while building long-term positive results. I'm also sure you all know there is a new generation of retail investors, counting already more than 200 million people just between North America and Europe, who trade through several platforms by proving a huge market opportunity. What you may not know is that when we survey Gen Z and millennials retail investors by asking what tool they use in order to create and manage their investment strategies, more than 75% reply none, while the rest reply they were forced to use homemade spreadsheets. Still, when we asked them if they were willing to improve their investing skill in order to become more expert, more than 80% reply definitely yes. And that's why at Merlin Investor, we are on a mission to democratize financial inclusion and investment planning towards conscious investing. The Merlin platform is an educational, strategizing, and tracking tool that can be used with any kind of asset, it's complementary to any trading platform, and is designed for any kind of retail investors. To financial institutions, we offer the opportunity to embed our wide-label technology into their own digital platform to differentiate and gain a competitive advantage by going beyond the sole execution of trades. In this way, they can attract and retain customers inside their platform along the full investment cycle and not just for the trading part. So let me now give you a quick tour of our technology. I'll now go through the desktop application, but we also offer the same with, for, for mobile, with both being already released into the market and being 100% equivalent. Doesn't matter if we invest our own or somebody else's money. Doesn't matter if we are an expert or a beginner investor. The first step in the investment cycle should always be study the market and retrieve as much data as possible towards an informed decision. And that's why we designed the inspiration section where we consolidate different sources of inspiration all in one place. The user is actually able to cherry pick those sources he wants to add to the workspace for a tailor-made experience. Just a quick scroll, we start with the more traditional sources like news from different financial media, and then economic calendar showing those macroeconomic events that may trigger market movements. Then we have technical indicator giving the market sentiment about specific assets. And then, let me stop here, we also include social networks. The reason why we include such a network is because when we survey the same population by asking what was the main source they rely on when deciding what to buy, well, more than 60% reply social network or social network influencers. And that's why we make accessible directly from our platform social network like X, YouTube, then we have Reddit, and many other sources. And if the inspiration section is still not enough to decide what asset to buy, we also have a market section with a tons of data about a wide range of assets. Then, now that we started the market, let's move to the next step. Let's create our own investment strategy. The first step is to decide if we want to start from scratch or from a strategy we created before. Then we need to input some general information about our strategy. We need to give it a name, we need to choose a reporting currency. In the advanced setting, we can uh, choose a time frame in order to be notified when it expires. Then we choose a color, we can assign tags, either preset tags, or we can create our own. The following step is to decide how we want to import the asset. And we have two options. We can do it either manually or automatically by connecting a bank account, a trading platform, or a crypto wallet. We now go with the manual option. Then we need to pick the asset class. We offer several asset classes, but we also give you the possibility to create your own asset class so that you are able to consolidate alternative investment as well. We now go with stock. Here, we will need to look for the stock we want to add to our strategy, and then we will need to, um, to input additional information about that specific asset. We choose Tesla, we need to confirm the purchasing day, the purchasing price, the quantity. In the advanced setting, we can input a stop profit and stop loss in order to be notified when such risk boundaries are reached. Then we can also add a custodian. Let's assume we have this on eToro trading platform, and then an inspirational source. Let's assume 
we invest on this from uh, um, X influencer. Such additional information will be useful later on to dive even more deep in our analysis and tracking of the performance. We will repeat all the process I'm now going through until our strategy is completed, and then we will find our strategy under the portfolio section. And here, if we click on a specific strategy, we are able to move to the next step and go to analyze it. Also here, we have a widget library, in this case, a tracking widget library. The user can pick those widgets they want to add to the workspace. Then a very quick scroll, because we provide a tons of information. We have an asset summary that gives you an overall picture of your investment. Then you can analyze your portfolio in terms of asset class risk, in terms of industry, in terms of custodian and inspirational source. That's why we added that information before. In terms of currency, in terms of country, exchange. We can understand how every asset, asset class, industry, currency, and country contributing to the overall performance of the strategy. We can track how the performance of each asset as well as of the whole strategy is performing against the stop profit and loss that we set. We can even set our own risk rate in terms of asset concentration risk, in terms of geographical, currency, and industry risk, and then we automatically calculate the overall strategy risk based on the user input. Then we can compare more assets at the same time. We can see the biggest swing in terms of price and volume change. We can compare our strategy against a benchmark. We can backtest our strategy. We, never, we even have widgets for tracking NFT collection or bonds. So many, many possibilities to dive deep in our analysis. We also have a compare section with its own dedicated widget library, which is done for comparing more strategies strategies at the same time. So to summarize, I have just shown you how you can easily study the market to retrieve different data from different sources, but only one place towards an informed decision. Then I have shown you how you can create your own infinite set of investment strategy. And again, you can do either manually or automatically. And last, I have shown you how you can easily analyze and track the performance of your portfolio. So if you are a financial institution seeking to attract the new generation of retail investors and willing to learn more about our wide label technology for a complete investment experience all in one place, please reach out to us and we'll be happy to tell you more. Let me close by thanking you all for your kind attention and by welcoming you to Merlin Investor, the ultimate realm of retail investment planning and management. Thank you.